it's really time for us all to draw near to the Lord Jesus Christ. I pray that you have eyes that see and ears that can hear. The Lord said that those that are in rebellion cannot hear his voice. And he desires for us to hear his voice. He says that his sheep will hear his voice. But if his sheep are in rebellion, they are not going to hear him. We need really to humble ourselves and come back into his presence. Ask his forgiveness. Ask him to search our hearts and ask his forgiveness for every sin and for our deafness for our blindness and ask him to put our feet back on that narrow way because he's going to come very very soon and we're not ready we've been asleep and he is calling us now to get the oil in our lamp don't be a foolish boy it's really time for us to get in the ark and the Yeshua Messiah, He is the Ark. He is the only Ark that we have. And the only way that we are going to make it through is to be walking in His Spirit. We have to hear His voice because we need to follow the Holy Spirit. We've got to come out of the world just like He's told us. We've got to let go of those things that are hindering us and to reach for Him and let everything else go. What is it going to profit if you lose your whole soul by gaining the whole world? See, the world belongs to Satan. God gave it to him. And he gives Satan, he gives the world to whoever will serve him. That's a sobering thought if you ever let it get down inside of you and let that revelation come alive in you and you understand it might turn you around. I hope so. Don't gain the world and lose your salvation to lose what God has given you. He has given you Christ. He has given you Christ so that you can believe on Him and receive Him. And the Word says if you will believe in your heart and confess with your mouth that Jesus Christ is Lord, you shall be saved. That's how it begins is in a heart when we believe. If you believe in your heart, then confess it. Confess him before men. That is where salvation begins. Those are your first steps. Follow him. Believe in him and follow him. God bless you.